Okay, so there's a few things we need to check. First of all, it's possible that the sound is going to be too loud. Hello, roommate. You're here just in time for the stream. Okay, so the audio balance could be screwed up here. Um, my other issue... Settings. Which of these do I want? I want this one, right? This is the... Um, yeah, it's, it's on the Japanese soundtrack. Don't be that way. Yeah, I'm playing this so I can play Mania, by the way. This is correct, right? This is the Sonic CD spin dash, which is like not like the Sonic 2 one. Is this thing on? I have, yeah, when they were new. Uh, I'll probably replay them, though. Since, like, with the uh, 100 game thing over, I don't feel like I'm totally against uh, replaying stuff. Also, <laughs> it was running at 144 frames a second when I got this. <laughs> this was uh, quite a bit of work. Duh! Thank you, Allie. <laughs> I got spooked. We gotta watch this. Oh, is this where the missing song is, by any chance? I gotta turn my speakers down a little bit. What a dark ending. <laughs> the Death Star. Okay. This is definitely not 144 frames a second. By the way, Sonic is really fucking hard at 144 FPS. Okay, so this is how it's supposed to work, right? Weird, and like... This is so strange. Isn't the story here like that the two teams for Sonic 2 and for Sonic CD independently invented the spin dash? Is that wrong? Um, okay, so, oh god. You know how in uh, the Sonic 2 game, um, when you spin dash, you like hold down and then the more times you mash A, the faster your dash gets? Um, this is like, you hold down and then you charge A. I think you need to charge it for a while and then you let go of down and you do this. Oh, nice. Yeah, I don't know anything about this one or really many of the Sonics, but okay. <laughs> Past. Future. <laughs> I don't know anything about this game, <laughs> so I don't know what effect that had, if any. Future. 
Oh, is it like you need to flip all of the signs to be the same thing or something? Yeah, there's time travel in, in Sonic CD. I don't know if that's what this is or what. If I'm not mistaken, they were also thinking about giving Sonic 2 a time travel plot as well, and so they went back on that decision when it, they figured out what the Sonic CD team was working on. Well, I'm at the goal. Was I supposed to do that? <laughs> oh, okay. Made a good future in Zone 1. And I assume that's good. <laughs> or they wouldn't call it that. Anyway, normally I wouldn't be cool with like playing a remake like this, but I could sort of see the Sonic games benefiting from 16x9. Although I didn't have any problem with Sonic 1. And, um, for all everybody complains about, like, 2 and 3, how you can build up too much speed and then not see enemies coming, whoops, it never bothered me. <laughs> like, I know why people say that. I'm not gonna be like, I don't know what you're talking about, I've never run into an enemy in a Sonic game, but it just doesn't seem like that big a deal. This is an official remake, yes. Uh, I believe this person went on to make Sonic Mania. The, like, lead coder for this or whatever was on that project, but I'm not sure. Ah. So is this the bad ending, then? Bad future? Oh, really? Okay. Oh, I just realized what's going on. Like, you have to build up enough speed to travel through time. Is that right? Interesting. What a mysterious game. So, like, it should happen again here, right? Yeah. That's cool. Hey, dinner. Good to see you. And here I am again. <laughs> yeah, that was actually what the achievement was called. Meaning, I guess I should have figured... Whoops. Okay. Should have figured out what was going on there, but of course I didn't. Whoops. So when people complain about this game, like having levels that are too big and confusing, is this what they mean? Like you go into the past and then you have to find the thing to blow up and that's hard? or annoying, or whatever. Whoops. Oh, okay. Ah, uh, yeah, don't spoil anything. Because I don't care what ending I get, I'm pretty sure I'm going to have a good time even if I uh, don't get the good ending or whatever, so... There's no need.
Oh. Oh, what? I outran the thing. Am I not trying to get the what's it? Hmm? I'm so fucking confused. Give me that. <laughs> How does this game work? Yeah, this is remastered. <laughs> So did I do pretty good on this special stage? <laughs> Thank you. I'll need it, apparently. <laughs> They're like similar in Sonic Mania, right? The stages. This is, like, weird. Like, a lot of these spring placements make it really difficult to explore these, like, no, don't. these special areas up here. Like, I want that stuff. <laughs> it's so challenging to get that. Oh my god, are you kidding? Of course it will be. <laughs> I don't, I hope it is anyway. I don't have the first idea what I'm doing. Oh my god. What if I just like... Okay, I can't do that. Please. It's so hard to like... walk over the edges and turn back in this for some reason. Oh, it's a boss stage, huh? Yeah, I really do. I've played a lot of the Sonic games, but the only one I've done recently was Sonic 1. Everything else was like I played them when they were new. favorite character. No, fuck off. The super peel out. What's the super peel out? Oh, up and jump? Whoa! I don't know what this is for, but it fucking rules. Look at this. Woogoosh. It's for traveling through time, I guess. Huh, where the fuck am I going? out of here. No, I'm not. Oh, yeah, I am. Huh? Oh, the fucking... Wait, can I just time travel like this? Will this work eventually? 
Is it hot? It's not super hot where I am. I mean, it's hot, but... Not any more than usual. Hmm? Oh my god. You do have to wonder what, what this is for. I guess you go faster, don't you, than you do with the spin dash? Like, you can't get the sparks just from spin dashing, but you can from doing this. I thought. Oh. Like, it's so weird that this was developed side by side with two, because I don't remember that enemy being in one. And <laughs> there was a really similar enemy in two. Am I just misremembering? Are those things in one? The, like, praying mantis enemies? <laughs> I wanted to call them manta rays, but... Wouldn't be the first manta ray mishap on this stream. Right, yeah, it's like if there's not some fringe benefit like that to spin dashing, then why would you ever do it? Yeah, it does seem like the they're differentiated by their charge times, too. But I'm not, like, sitting here counting seconds or anything. Huh? <laughs> what a mysterious game. <laughs> what? Where am I going? Can you, like, spin dash in this thing or something? Like, what's the point? <laughs> this... No, it just spits you out real slow, like... I was trying to go to the future. What? Where are you taking me? Huh. Fuck. Huh. Huh. I reacted in time to make a silly noise, but not like do anything about it. hard. Whatever's up here has got to be worth it, right? They wouldn't just make a ridiculously hard platforming section without rewarding you enough for it. <laughs> this has never happened in this series. You know, <laughs> Denier, I don't know. This sort of reminds me of, um, Gemini Man's stage, in that it has tadpole eggs. <laughs> There's got to be a better word for that than tadpole eggs.
Back to the past. Nice. Yeah, I thought about it too, Samurai Jack. Oh, that wasn't really my. Oh, what the fuck? My generation, though. I was, um. Fuck, I was already, like, hanging out at arcades and playing DDR all the time and shit when Samurai Jack came out. I think that might be the goal. Oh, you asshole. That was probably good, right? The tragedy here is, um, for all the talk and the music and going to the trouble of making sure I pick the right soundtrack and everything. I can't hear it myself because our air conditioner is extremely loud, so. Okay, all right. Oof. I don't want to play Sonic Spinball. <laughs> I had a friend who had that game. There we go. Well, that was productive. <laughs> what am I even doing? How do I move on? Questions for therapy. Fuck. Oh, hey. Oh, that would be cool. This is impossible. Where am I even going? Fuck, okay. Oh, that was... I, I saw that one. It was... It, was funny, but it looks like a very tough run. <laughs> I mean, no disrespect to the uh, runner or anything. <laughs> Just a whole lot can go wrong, I guess, because a whole lot did. Okay, and now what? You go up here, and then you... All right, all right. <laughs> How do you get out? I've been here for like two minutes. Um, you picked the wrong level to ask that. <laughs> this one is just a little confusing at the moment.
Seven more minutes, you think? Ah, yes. The time limit joke. Classic. Well, I couldn't get the blue sparks, so I could just time travel. Whoa, what the fucking... Like, is there not an easier shot up to the second level here than through the gap in the flippers? You can't do anything here, can you? Maybe you can't. Okay. Aha! That... that was actually a non-starter. That's okay. Oh, I thought I got out. Oh shit, this is a boss, isn't it? <laughs> Has this been the boss the whole time? Okay, yes, that's Robotnik. Whatever he's called. That was tough. <laughs> that was rough. This song is good. I like this level a lot. Also, how many, like, zones are there? Seven, so this is what? Three, I think. Gimme bubbles. Hey, there we go. Hmm? I would like a bubble. You only get one per... Nope. Bubble factory. Hmm? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Where are you taking me? Wait a sec. There we go. Uh, you need to... You need to guarantee that Sonic Land, you know, Monsteropolis or whatever it's called, um... see is a good future, happy future. And so I guess you have to go into the past and break stuff.
I know Monsteropolis is Mega Man. This is wild how the music doesn't change here because it was a CD game, so that would mean, like, changing tracks. Oh, give me the bubble. What's even fucking happening? I get. <laughs> I am essentially not in control here. Uh, you can explain the mechanics of the time travel thing, yeah. Because I'm just going to ignore it if I don't feel like it's going to make me have more or less fun. Knowing it or not knowing it. There we go. Ah, good shot. Uh-oh, I'm not gonna... <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> that sound effect. Okay. <laughs> Time rings. <laughs> I want that. That one will do. I did a very good job of time traveling here. So I think this is where I like started. Or where I went to the, I guess that was future. So now I should be in the present day. And now if I time travel again, I'll get to go to the past, right? Huh, that's cool. Oh, I'm gonna die. I should have just hit the... Oh, okay. Halfway point. Can I... Does this go two ways? No. Can you time travel like this? Yeah, you can. <laughs> it happened again. Okay, so this should be the past, right? <clears throat> okay, um... Since it's clear that this isn't a game that necessarily benefits from a no-spoiler rule. <laughs> My next question is, what is the goal of these special stages? Do I blow up the blue UFO? Is that the deal? There's more than one blue UFO. Oh, do you blow up all the UFOs, maybe? Oh, well, we'll never know. <laughs> The game had enough of me. Is that what it is? Okay. That seems hard. Oh, all right. And that's one of the ways that you can get the... Uh, the good ending, is that right? Whoops. <laughs> no. 
I even have the 16 by 9 aspect ratio. There's like no excuse. Past. Okay. No, I wanted to go up there. <laughs> okay, so in theory, there are plenty of chances to uh, to get the good ending through that method. It's just like the bonus levels are hard. Unless they're not hard once you know what you're doing. Which I could also see that being the case. No! Oh, the Swiss cheese, like, moves with you. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, um, I don't have, uh, a Mega CD. <laughs> so, like, that was the other reason I wanted to do this, because... Really, I can't play it any other way. I do want to get um, get one eventually, but they're kind of a pain to find in working order now, is what I've been told. Cheese them, huh? Oh, okay. <laughs> You have to jump, like, so, so much earlier than I would normally be inclined to. <laughs> this went even worse! Because you pick up these shoes! And, <laughs> and then you get in the water. No, come on. <laughs> no. Oh, you lose a lot of time for that. Damn. Yeah, I think the we had him backwards. Time harvested. Time harvested is never time wasted, you know what I'm saying? Time harvested is a penny earned. That's what they say. Ah, huh, there was something that way. Yeah, that. <laughs> Don't worry about it. That <laughs> makes two of us. Oh no. Oh, that's gonna happen again. No, it's not. This is a cool boss fight. Oh, 
He waited for me. <laughs> that was nice. Oh. I wonder if I still think this is a cool fight. He just died. Oh, no, he didn't. Do I get these? Okay. Ass. I thought it was going to be like that boss in 2 where you wanted to wait for the barrier to go horizontal, but that doesn't seem to happen ever. Yeah, that one. <laughs> now I'm in a real pickle. This is cool, though. Oh, nuts. <laughs> There's something weird about that death animation. It's like... Not as big a production as I'm expecting. That fucking voice clip is so good. invincibility. The fucker wore it out. What was the point of that? <laughs> Got greedy there. Good. Good one. There we go. Zone 3. I had legitimately forgotten how far I was. <laughs> Yeah, I finally added it. Give me that. Oh, this song is really good. Okay. Oh, interesting. I feel like there aren't that many enemies in this game at any point. Did I just die? I don't get what stopped me there.
You can't achieve time travel velocity by running against these, can you? Oh, weird. I didn't do that this time around though, right? No! That's a fucking thing! My rings. Oh no. God damn it. Wait, so I'm I'm confused again. Um so is it now not possible for me to go to the past? And I don't have the ability again until I um hit a sign that says past or something. A thingy in the bottom left. Right, yeah. Wild. <laughs> I had all that time to think to myself, you know, there's probably an enemy at the end of this. <laughs> and I, like, was barely looking. at it with that jump. <laughs> so, what's the incentive to, like, go to the future? It's just to see the future versions of the levels, I guess. Are there, like, power-ups that are only accessible in the future and stuff like that? Okay. I like the rollout. No. So about rollout. Tell me about rollout. Hmm. <laughs> I'm confused. Oh, I get it, yeah. I think I can figure it out.
Oh my god, there we go. Damn, I was trying to, like, slow down. <laughs> what in the world is going on with this boss fight? You just wait it out? <laughs> what? Wait, what was this zone called? Ah, oh, whatever. Oh, this level is cool. So, like, are these graphics totally unaltered from the the Sega CD version? Oh, come back. What? <laughs> huh. Okay, so what is altered? Beyond like it defaulted to the Sonic 2 spin dash. Yeah, it's 16 by 9. What a trap. <laughs> no. <laughs> Playable Tales, okay. How do you achieve um, time travel speed in this level? <laughs> Tails per hour, god damn it! Oh, oh like, like so? Cause like everywhere you go, you bounce into a wall. I have lost the time travel juice though, so it no longer matters. Oh, okay. Evening K Price. Oh god. <laughs> this is so hard this jump. Duh. Damn it. I'm not gonna get that MI. I am. Oh no. No! <laughs> wow. Yes, one ring. <laughs> Very well played.
You know what this reminds me of? That thing that they used to do with like basketball players. It was called like slam ball or something. Where you would like fill a, a basketball court with trampolines. It, you know what I mean? It actually got like outlawed because people were like tearing tendons playing it and stuff. Huh? Okay. Okay. No. No. <laughs> this is so awkward. Oh, and I can't do my usual pause buffer strats. This, yeah. Are they mechanically the same in this port? It's time for whilst. Oh, they're not mechanically the same because you can't mash a many times to get up to the top speed faster. Like, not across games, anyway. Oh, these fucking Tilt-A-Whirl ones. Okay. Forgot the um, the fuck. What is that thing called? The you know it goes before S in a possessive. That's not an apostrophe, is it? It is. <laughs> you forgot the apostrophe. No, I lost it. I had it. I'm trying to like There's potential for funny looking stuff there, but I'm not gonna try to unleash that potential. Oh. There we go. This song is good. No. What happened? No. There was a spring there. <laughs> I...
Not 12 minutes. Don't be ridiculous. <laughs> this is such a confusing level. so hard to like figure out like the timing for jumping off of this. It's actually easy. <laughs> I always get those mixed up. So what is that what they call it little planet is that where is that where they live Sonic and friends oh okay Right, the the Death Star looking thing. <laughs> I was holding right. You don't want to do that. <laughs> no, I wanted to play this before I played Mania. No. I know you can get down there and get that shield, but now that I have no rings... Well, I got, I got startled. I, I don't think I can do that on command. Huh? Okay. Oh, dude, give me those. Okay, remind me what other benefits the Sega CD had. It, it's not just the um, CD drive itself. There was like some other benefit, like it had more memory or something. I think it also improved the capabilities of the, um... Huh? Of the FM synth chip. Oh, this boss is tight! No. Oh. Okay, but do you really think I need to play 2 and 3 again um, before touching Mania? See, like that, that has to happen for that particular lightning to strike again. Oh. <laughs> Why? Why did it happen with the word Mania both times? 
I was looking at chat. <laughs> it's definitely on me. Oh. Oh. Yep. Three rings. Anyway, I ask... My... Yeah, I, I was thinking about that too. The mania on the floor. <laughs> um... I ask because this game is, like, doing all of this, like, super fast scrolling through, like, 19 screens of shit. Which sort of makes me wonder if that was something that they needed the CD drive to do. Or the CD add-on. I did play it as a children. See, it's been a long time, but I feel like I played those games, like, a lot, relatively. It, it beefs up the... Should I stop calling it Genesis? <laughs> it beefs up the Genesis in some other way, um, that Final Fight takes advantage of, for example. What? <laughs> he died, but then... <laughs> it's like more memory or something, and, and I do believe it also... You're somehow capable of better FM synth sound with the, the CD. I thought... <laughs> what even happened to me? I don't get it. I'm not gonna do three and knuckles, I think. I mean, I guess I could. I have all the carts and everything. Although, I don't know when I'm gonna get my OSSC back from the, the electronics repair place that I really didn't need to take it to. It's so long. It's so long, Sonic and Knuckles. Maybe the spike doesn't... Yeah. You have to... Okay. Which means that you do, in fact... Um, functionally get more out of the FM synth because it's doing less work for the um, samples if you go that route, of course. Future. I don't want to go to the future. No. Huh. There we go. Fast I'll do. Oh, this stage is good. Yeah, you know I lose it over beats like this. 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> A whole two in the entire game. Let's not uh, jump to conclusions. Where the fuck am I going? Oh, do I have to go back to the present, present time now? This is so weird. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna let go of right. Yeah, so now the speed cap doesn't. That's not even an issue of it capping my speed, though. That's. He, he was just switching direction. Oh my god. No. I guess I don't need to go through that whole song and dance, though. Yeah, this level is really good. Oh, I killed all the enemies, right? Because I hit the... the nightmare machine or whatever. Future. Oh my god. There we go. It's... I'm surprised by how easy it is to get stuck. But I mean, I think that's, that's like supposed to be the game telling you to go time travel, right? Is, is that the idea? Somehow I always end up back down here and stuck. I'm not touching the D-pad. <laughs> it took that long to return to neutral. There we go. God, I... I don't know why I <laughs> I didn't see that. All right, we're back on track for now. <laughs> I guess this is here so you can get time travel velocity and keep it. <laughs> There's a few situations like, or whatever you would say, uh, setups like that in this game where you just hit the D-pad once and then wait. Bounce around in a loop. Oh, pass. No. Future. future. Not future. Oh shit, the future looks tight as hell now. Right, because I broke the bad future gun. The goal's right there. How do I get to the goal? What? I'm stuck. Are you, does it involve this somehow? Oh, those were like... Uh... The things for trains. 
You know the ones. So all those times that I was quote unquote stuck, I just wasn't understanding that mechanic. I did. Now there's a hell of a game, Rocket Knight. <laughs> Are you really? <laughs> yeah, the railroad switch thing. I don't know what you would call that. Other than the rail the railroad switch thing. Uh. Oh! Light bulb monsters. Duh, the fucking... There we go. I done it. Oh, is this the fastest zone in Classic Sonic? Duh. Metal Sonic Hollow? What? How do you get a Metal Solic... Solic Hano? <laughs> the fuck is a Samo flinch? <laughs> Wait, so how do you get the Metal Sonic Hollow? I don't, I think I missed this, uh... This information. I'm just gonna let this happen while you... <laughs> while you inform me. And check my IMs and stuff. Doing shit, huh? Okay. No, not future. There we go. That's one way not to go to the future. Yeah, because I don't think I got the Metal Sonic in, um... Oh, I did. In Act 1. I just didn't... Or Zone 1 or whatever. I just didn't notice. So I need to find another past sign. How do you, like, find where the Metal Sonic is, though? I mean, I, I guess you explore. Huh. Maybe. Dude, this this zone is so cool. I don't want to like accidentally go to the goal.
Huh, I see. This is tight, this zone. <laughs> is, is that a Star Wars joke, I guess? <laughs> I did it. so hard. It's really like you have to jump a lot earlier to get these than I than my instincts say I do. It kind of looks like you fall in technology instead of water in this one. Boots are so bad for this, or the, you know, the sneakers. Hey, does the stream have um, quality options right now, by the way? Oh, hey. Hmm. Really? They've been so much stingier with that lately. I used to get them like every single stream, even when I had like lower average viewership than I do now. Why is he so fast? Oh, I guess he rolled out. Fucking... <laughs> you fuck. What even hit me? That's the game over beat. Sonic C, the Hedgehog D. It's always how I'm gonna read that. How do I get that? Oh, do you have to have... Is Super Sonic even in this? He wasn't in Sonic 1, right? But... Were those not in the, uh, what's it version then? Original?
Oh, Sonic. Super Sonic is an IC. No. Dude. Yeah. Oops. Who are you, Rambro? No. Ah, uh, fuck. Fuck. <laughs> it, like, pushed me to the left. I see there was like a spring there. Oh, hey. Goodness. Huh? What? Okay. I found the spikes. Huh? Oh. Ah, these things. No. I saw my mistake, but only after I'd pressed the jump button. Okay. 
This is like... There we go. <laughs> that wasn't actually that hard. Also seems to be... No, we're good. No, oh, man. This is so tough. Um, it's fine. Now, how do I get enough speed? Does this work? No. <laughs> I guess there was another sign over there. <laughs> I just wanted to go to the past. Have you played this one through? You have, right? Oh, that just took me back to the beginning of the level. Oh my god. <gasps> Damn it. <laughs> I like I I'm so confused as to what exactly gets you to just lose the time travel power. Dude, I swear. Okay, hang on. Da, 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 da. Bounce like here. There we go. I just need a couple rings. There we go. What does this do? Huh? Well then. No. Hmm? That's awful. <laughs> No, I don't want to go to the future. Do you have work or something, Chris? Because I assure you, Sonic CD is more important than work. I, 
I timed that, like, as wrong as you can. Okay. So... Oh. No! Fucking... Huh? Oh, that does sound like an alarm clock. No, whatever. I don't even know where you would set up the time travel in that one. This doesn't have like level select once you beat it, does it? Like if I if I needed the time travel here, I think it would be easy, but Okay. my destiny to get confused by bombs in Sonic games. No. Oh, uh, this is like sort of sickening to look at. What a sequence. I gotta... I gotta not take this. Oh, yes. It is in fact mandatory. Wait, why'd I do that? It like got harder to get extra lives at some point in this game. I was sort of drowning in them at the beginning of the game and now... I've continued, what, twice?
Huh, okay. Huh. I... What did I do wrong the first time? I must have jumped on the wrong leg. Okay, I don't think this does. I thought it was gonna smash you against the ceiling. Dude, you just can't hit them at all. These never turn off, do they? Oh. <laughs> what a silly looking sprite. <laughs> What's the point? go. All right. Okay. I, this isn't the right way. <laughs> I tricked myself. you go this way then? Oh my god. Uh, what? Right, okay. I'm still not entirely sure I didn't go backwards. <laughs> oh good. <laughs> Amazing placement right there. This is... Oh. Whew. Tough level. <laughs> At least it's over. Oh. oh. There are some really, like, baffling power-up placements in this game where it's like, what's this invincibility for? I guess you can jump into these. But it's possible there's, like, a puzzly thing you're supposed to do with them that I'm missing. Huh? Oh. <laughs> that was, I think, the first bottomless pit that I've encountered in this game. There may have been others, but I, like, 
masked my way over them. Oh, right, yeah, that exists. You can go here. Her mind doesn't do anything. Right, how do you get this? <laughs> it's just three rings. Wow. I was a little disappointed that I continued earlier since, you know, I one CC'd Sonic 1 first try, but now I get the impression it would take some kind of incredible luck and, like, ridiculous intuition to beat this game without continuing on your first playthrough. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> what even hit me? I got crushed against the collapsing platform for, like, a frame. I did it. Like, the jump uses up the uh, sound channel for the buzzsaw, which... lets you time this or something or like I'm scrolling the buzzsaw off oh my god what's even happening Whew. tricky section Oh, good. <laughs> oh, that works. Dude, <laughs> this stage is hard. Gamed over. Yeah, that's like the fourth one or third one or something. Oh, I should have gotten those rings. Oh, whatever. Goddamn. It's so hard to hit this thing without hitting the beam, too. I don't get it. Oh, I get it. 
So you just have to wait till it spawns low enough for you to do that. Tricky. That's sick. <laughs> That's weird that jumping directly into the boss wasn't the right strategy. <laughs> it still wasn't. No. Huh? No. I mean, it's not deliberate, it's just <laughs> when you get hit, you might as well. I got an achievement for that. Oh, wild. So is this like the bad ending or whatever? It can't be, right? That was such an underwhelming boss fight. Huh. Oh. <sighs> Pretty damn. Oh, okay. Yeah, you got here right after Stardust Speedway, I think. Okay, so my question is, can I, like, go back in this save and get good futures in the acts I missed? Look at that, that was sick. I can't read Big Island as Big Island, it just looks like Biggest Land. You did. Although this isn't a good ending. I was hoping no one would go there. Sonic, you can do anything. <laughs> oh, was this also a vocal ending theme in the original? I'm curious, though, what it would take to get the good ending from this point. <laughs> yeah, that's a right thing, I guess. Oh. 
No. Why not? Does it require, like, another full playthrough? Huh! Yeah, I'm not seeing, like, a level select or anything. Whoop! I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> um, I'm gonna be honest, I expected this to take an hour longer than it did, so I don't have anything planned. <laughs> I'm not going to start a four-job fiesta, but only because it ended four days ago. Or else that, that would be a good idea. Um, I could just end stream at this point. I would do Sonic 2. My OSSC is currently in the... Uh... In the shop. Yeah, um, the case is cracked, and I'm having them replace it, even though I could have done it myself, because I really don't want to screw it up. Uh, uh, I, uh, I don't know what I could get done in Pokemon in like an hour. Give me just a sec, I'll be right back. Was the demo silly? I didn't even see it. Oh, it's like actually good. Oh, I see. How does Tails work? No rollout. But can fly, <laughs> which is something. How long can you do this? Oh, he gets like tired when he can't do it anymore, yeah. <laughs> 
something's blocking my way. Hey, what's with this? This, like, never happened again. <laughs> it's just this one place early in the game where you go, Whoa! And that's it. No. What? Can Tails always, like, damage with his tail when he's flying? That, that looks like... Is that legit? Huh. That just goes to show I didn't play much Sonic 2. <laughs> Although, I feel like I used Tails a lot in 3, because there's like stuff that I couldn't figure out how to deal with, so I would just fly over it. Oh, there's nothing up there. How do you know I haven't? Maybe I have. <laughs> no, the time travel. <laughs> uh, I like it, but it's not something that I would like want to play all the time, I think. Like, the level design seemed kind of baffling at first when I didn't realize how the time travel stuff worked, and once you do, it, it makes sense that, you know, they kind of put a lot of roadblocks up because it's sort of a puzzle to figure out how exactly to set up a, enough space to achieve liftoff or whatever. Um... And, like, it really does feel like Sonic 1, 2, you know? Which is why I stopped just sort of charging to the end and, it, and like, made at least a cursory effort to time travel when I could. Um, because it, it really seemed like sort of missing the point if I just sort of ran to the end as fast as I could. Wow, you really cannot fly up fast. So I think it's fine. Um, I Somehow I've been, like, conditioned to dislike this game, or, like, led to expect that I would dislike it, is what I meant to say. And that wasn't the case. Um, you know, like... I like Sonic 1 a lot, and so it was always a little disappointing how, like, the rest of the series departed from it a little bit, you know, to accommodate the going really fast all the time that everyone wants to do and, and all that. So definitely as a vision of, like, what could have been, it's cool. I actually like the boss fights a lot, too. I know they were, like, kind of among the weirder parts of the game, but... Um... Like... 1, 2, and 3 have maybe not the most interesting boss fights. Knuckles Chaotix, huh? Um... You know, if I could get my hands on a 32X, I could play that on hardware. I don't know if that sounds entertaining. Chaotix is weird. I I had a roommate that was really into Sonic. And uh, I did watch him play 
Chaotix a little bit. But I do think I'm probably more interested in replaying 2 and 3 than playing Chaotix. Really, what goes bad on them? I wasn't aware of that. My, I have a friend who, like, we go used game shopping every time he's in town, and he picked one up for, like, not a lot. Five, ten dollars, somewhere in there. Uh, graphically, I think this game's incredible. I'm actually not as big a fan of the music as I was expecting to be, because I always liked the music in Sonic games, but I don't know. It was there. Since I don't have anything else to do to fill time, though, I'm probably just going to cut stream here. What, this one? Oh, music-wise. Oh, hey, what's the American soundtrack like? Can this be changed here? No. Whoops. <laughs> Not as good. I see what you mean. Yeah, I'm not wild about this. Yeah, it really is. Well, it doesn't sound, like, Sonic-y at all. The other stuff was, like, really different, but it sounded more like Sonic music and less like... just sort of some Saturday morning cartoon. Which spin dash does this file have? That one. <coughs> Probably no one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Which one? The... If you're talking about the SNES one, that's um, Super Adventure Island. 4 was a Famicom game. Well, I skipped it. It was the whole reason that I went back there was to listen to Sonic Boom, and I skipped it. How do I delete? Found it. Okay, take two. Yeah, I want to play that one at some point. I've played a lot of other... Well, I've played Super Adventure Island and Adventure Islands 1 and 2. Oh, you know what? I know this song. Super Sonic Flight Gotta keep it 
yeah, thank you for watching. Um, I'll be back on Thursday, but I actually don't know what I'm playing yet. Um, it's going to depend. If I get my OSSC back in time, um, I might do Rystar or something, or Ristar. Um, but my mind isn't made up there. Yeah, I'll do Pokemon if I don't stream on Saturday, which it's looking like I'm not likely to. Yeah, I knew someone was gonna. We all know it's Rister. But, thanks for watching. Um, I'll see you later in the week. When precisely and what precisely I'll be doing, I'm not sure. Uh, let's see. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> oh, I should probably not bother with 3D Blast, right? I, that doesn't look like a dot game to me personally. Ah, yes. That's perfect. You can save plenty of time in keystrokes that way. Well, anyway, I'll figure this out later. Thank you. See you.